BIME's unique Query Blender tool allows you to join different data sources together in order to create blended queries. That's to say, queries that use elements from multiple data sources. Here in this example, I'm going to start with my Excel sales data, which I'm going to wish to join to my Google Analytics website data. So I'm going to first find my website data and add it into the Query Blender. From here, all I need to do is create a link between the two data sets. Next, we need to choose a join definition. Essentially, what we need to do is join these data sets together using a common key, something that can be found in both sides. In this case, we're going to use date. So date from our Google Analytics and date, ship date from our Excel sales data. We'll have to add this condition in and select the type of join, either inner, left, or right. When I click on OK, BIME is going to check the join to see if there are matching values between the two sides. If there aren't, you will see an error. In this case, BIME has found the matching values, so we're going to save the Query Blender. And in our Query Builder, we'll now have access to both sets of data, both our sales data and our website data. So let's create a blended query. I'm going to take my profit from my sales data and sessions from my Google Analytics website data and add them together. And here we can see them side by side. Because we use date as the joining condition in our query blender, we can now use date in our query to see the data from the both sets together. So let's add year and month from either side of the Query Blender. And here we can see the data side by side in a single query. Joining keys are essential to help BIME to understand how to break down and distribute the data. To give you an example, I'm going to add region from my sales data into rows of my query. What you'll notice is that most of the data is in fact undefined. And this is because region doesn't exist as a joining condition, so BIME doesn't know how to break down the sessions from my Google Analytics data by region. If region were to exist in both sets of data, I would need to add it as a joining condition. Joining conditions in the Query Blender can also be used to link to other data in a different data set. Let's give you an example. Here I have profit by region based on the year 2015. I also have a managers spreadsheet, which I've connected to in BIME, which contains the region name, the manager associated, their date of birth, and their profit target for 2015. In my Query Blender, I've created the join using region as it exists on both sides of the join. This allows me now to add my targets from my manager targets data to see them side by side. However, because region and the name of the manager for that region are unique in terms of the joining key, I can also now add manager and we'll see manager appear correctly in our data. Even though the manager field doesn't exist in my main sales data, 